Lena had always been uneasy about the attic. Its door creaked ominously at the end of the hall, and she avoided it whenever possible. But tonight, an inexplicable urge compelled her to investigate the strange noises emanating from above. Gripping a flashlight, she ascended the rickety steps, each creak echoing her growing dread. The air was stale and heavy, filled with the scent of ancient dust and decay. Her flashlight beam cut through the darkness, revealing forgotten relics and cobwebs. Then she saw it, a shadow that didn't match any object in the room. It slithered across the wall, pausing as if it sensed her presence. Lena's heart pounded. She moved closer, drawn by a mix of fear and curiosity. The shadow morphed, taking on a vaguely human shape. It turned and seemed to regard her with empty, soulless eyes. A whisper slithered through the air, her name uttered in a chilling tone. Paralyzed, she watched as the shadow extended a hand, fingers like tendrils of darkness reaching out to her. She stumbled back, crashing into a pile of old boxes. The whisper grew louder, more insistent, filling her mind with unbearable dread. In a desperate bid to escape, Lena scrambled down the stairs, slamming the attic door shut behind her. She leaned against it, heart racing, breath coming in ragged gasps. The house fell silent, but she knew the truth. The shadow wasn't just in the attic, it was in her mind, a sinister presence that would never let her go.